Hello, viewers. Welcome to our channel once again. If you're just seeing our channel for the first time, this channel would provide relevant and affordable relocation opportunities to those who want to relocate to uh, uh, Portugal, where we reside, and to other beautiful European countries. And thank you very, very much for subscribing and for viewing my videos all the time when we drop uh, videos on this channel. And if you have not subscribe already you need to subscribe to this channel we drop relevant vocational opportunity relocation opportunities that are very very affordable and that do not require you to break the bank before you can achieve your relocation plan okay now as you all know i have another exciting opportunity to share with all my viewers and subscribers here today okay now if you are in that category of international applicants that are looking for a fully funded opportunity that do not i mean that do not restrict your choice of eu countries to go to your choice of courses or your cho choice of program yes that, that is an opportunity that i want to talk about today now the argos talent scholarship provide an affordable opportunity for all international applicants that are aiming to study overseas, abroad, or in EU, okay? They have partners, universities all, all over EU. I mean, about in, in 10 EU countries, they have partner, uh, I mean, universities. So which means you are eligible to choose your own universities or your own country, where you want to go to, where you want to relocate to. Now, this scholarship provides a fully funded tuition fees. It provides a monthly stipend of up to 1,400 euro monthly. Okay. And if you are if you are in that category of a, a master's student or PhD student that are, I mean that require a special attention with respect to if you have children that you want to that you want to relocate with, or if you are a special needs, you know, Down syndrome and the likes. They also provide an extra 250 euro for special needs applicant or special needs student. Okay, so today I will be sharing the details of this scholarship with respect to the benefits, the documents required, and how you can submit your application to any of the choosing partner universities. So they have partner universities in Portugal, they have partner universities in France, they have partner universities in Germany, in Sweden. I mean. In, in almost about 10 EU countries. So you will be the one to choose which universities or which country you want to relocate to for this master's program. Now, mind you, this master program does not require that you have already gained admission in any of these EU countries or their partners' universities, okay? It only requires that you have applied to any uh, 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 any master's program or PhD program in any of their partners university and of course you should be able to provide a proof with respect to probably uh, a confirmation email showing that you have successfully applied to a master's program or a, a, a PhD program in any of their partners universities in any EU country where they have partners okay. So I'll be showing to you the details about this scholarship, the benefits of the scholarship, the application document that are required and how you can submit your application and including the deadline as well. So come with me, let me show you the details about this scholarship. So as I said before, the name of the scholarship is Agos Talent Scholarship Fund, okay? So let me quickly say this, there is no age restrictions, there's no, um, IELTS required, particularly if you have uh, if you have been taught or if you have had your BSc program or um, MSc program previously taught in English. So there is no restrictions with respect to uh, um, um, IELTS that you have to provide IELTS or TOEFL and the likes. Okay, so this is Argos Talent Scholarship. Let's quickly check some of the. I mean, what it covers. So let's quickly check. The scholarship is composed of subsistence allowance of 1,400 euro monthly, which is expected to cover the student living cost, medical insurance, or material allowance. In addition, the scholarship would provide fully paid tuition fee. Fully funded tuition is also provided and a special need funds for students who are 
uh, who have special needs, who are asylum seekers and the likes. I will also show you those whom they, whom they, whom they, uh, whom they regard as special needs applicants. So an extra 250 euro uh, uh, is also provided for students who are considered as special needs, okay? So this, these are the students that are considered as special needs, okay? You are either a refugees or asylum seekers, students with caring responsibility of children between 0 to 18 months, okay? So, uh, yeah, or 18 years, 0 to 18. So that is 18 years. So you have a child. So if you are going, if you are an applicant, you have a child between the age of 0 to 18, then you are also considered a special needs. And of course, you have, you have to provide a birth certificate of your child to prove is or our age, okay? Student with disability and learning disability. So if you have any disability, of course, you also have to show proof. Student with chronic disease, medical confirmation, you also have to show proof. So any of these four categories, those are the people that they consider as special needs. So you are eligible to an extra 250 euros uh, with the uh, 1,400 monthly stipend that is compulsory for all uh, eligible applicants, okay? so. Um, Agua scholarship cannot be combined with other EU funded scholarships. So if you have any other scholarship, you cannot come, you cannot add this scholarship with any other scholarship that you have already uh, benefited from. Now, master student, according to the regular duration of choosing master's program, maximum 12 to 18 or 24 months. Okay, doctoral student, maximum 36 months. So that is the duration for which a master student and a PhD student can benefit for and benefit this um, scholarship. So, and there are other many informations that at your own spare time, you can also read in details what this scholarship entails. Now, let's quickly look at the application document, the document that is required for you to be able to submit your application. So, uh, confirmation of application to the entrance university. So, this means that you need to be able to provide a proof that you have applied to one of the universities in which they are partners, okay? So in any of the EU country, and like I said, you don't already need to have admission. You just need to show proof that you have applied to one of the universities which they are partner. And of course, it is only meant for masters and for PhD program. You also have to provide a motivation statement, which is a um, statement of purpose, showing your, your motivation for applying for this scholarship and the choosing program. If you are going for PhD, you need to provide a PhD research proposal. And then, of course, uh, your BSc, sorry, your BSc or master's certificate, depending of depending on if you're going for a master's program or PhD program. Transcript is also very important. The letter of recommendation, particularly if you have any lecturer to, you know, uh, write a reference letter or recommendation letter for you. But if you don't have any, you can show, you can provide any letter of recommendations from any notable men or women in the society. CV is also very important. International passport is so also very important. Students with fewer opportunities, please provide a confirmation according to the category for students with fewer opportunities under the section condition of the scholarship. Now, language certificates, Mary, please upload the proof of language proficiency, level B2 or higher of, of one of the language of the alliance, okay, that is, the language of alliance with respect to the uh, partners universities where you are going to study. So you need to provide a proof that you have been uh, taught in English. So that is why they said you have to provide a proof of language proficiency, okay? Now, if you have not yet received your uh, bachelor certificate, master certificate, and of course uh, uh, the, the scholarship application, I will, show that, I will show that to you shortly. You can also be considered if you are, if probably you have about three months to complete your program or thereabouts, and you want to be considered for this, you can send an email to this place so that they can uh, they will find a way to be able to provide some sort of assistance to your application. So the eligibility check once you this is selection process. Once you submit your application, they check your eligibility for the applications. Then they make some joint selections and ranking of applicants. Then uh, by July they announce the result okay so this is the deadline the various deadline that you need to pay important attention to they have about three phases for the applications the first call is for doctoral student only and that starts from the uh from 
uh, will run from the end of March 2023 to the end of May 2023. That has already ended. The second call is for uh, master student only. It will run from the early May 2023 to early to early July 2023. That has also ended. Now the third call, which is the one that is you know that is currently active for all international applicants to submit their application for, it will open from early April 2024 till the end of June 2024. So the application has already commenced and it will end by June ending 2024 for master student only. So that is the one that you can particularly pay attention to. Now, lastly, let me quickly show you this important information with respect to their partners, universities, type of courses that you can apply to, and the relevant deadline that you can use to submit your applications to these universities, to, to these partners, universities. So Agos universities. So we have the University of Granada, and then here yeah, you can check the date and deadline for submitting your application. And the, the deadline for submitting application to their master's program is from uh, 23rd of June to 5th of July, 2024. And when you check in here, you will be able to see the list of eligible master's program that falls under this category at the University of Granada in Spain. University of Graz, that is in Austria. So their applications, are, um, it, it runs from 15th of June, 2024, admission period, new enrollment. So online registrations from 15th of June. So which means the application period from University of Grass is until 15th of June next month. So, and of course, you can also check the pre-registrations platform to check the list of um, eligible master's program that you can apply to there. And the University of Leipzig, 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 I think this is in Germany, okay? So date and deadline as well from July to 30th of November. That is when you can submit your applications for uh, uh, University of Leipzig in Germany. University of Lyon, that should be in France from May to the end of June. That is their application period for master's program. University of Maine, I'm not sure which country this is, but applications are accepted between October and July each year. So, which means from July till October, you can submit you can just Google University of Mayo, which EU country this is. But University of Mayo, I know this one for a fact because that is my university. It's in Portugal, and the date and relevant deadline. Once you check, once you check, I mean, first phase at University of Mayo ended last week. So, and then uh, second phase will soon commence for master's program. So you can of course check here. Once you click on this link, you'll be able to see further information regarding the University of Mayo master's program. University of Padua, that should be in Italy, and the applications period are accepted between October and July each year as well. But you can check uh, for relevant exact, with, if you want an exact date, you can check or click on this link. Why University of Vilnius? I'm not sure where that is, but you can check online and the application period from May 1st for applicants from non-EU or ETA countries to to July 1st. So that is also the application period. So these are essential uh, applications period for master's program for the call, for the third call of the uh, Agos Talent Scholarship, which is currently ongoing. So you can try as much as possible to ensure that before the end of June, where, when the application portal will be um, um, closing for the scholarship, you ensure that you submit your application. And like they said, you only need to show proof that you have applied to one of these universities before you can submit your application to this um, score or for this scholarship. You do not already need to have admission, okay? You only need to show proof before you can apply for this scholarship. So I've shown to you the uh, benefit of the scholarship, the relevant deadline, the a relevant application period, the relevant partner universities for the Agos Talent Scholarship, and there are you know, uh, different partner universities in different EU countries. So you will be the one to decide which EU country you want to look into. And from what we've seen together, the, the application period are still active for if you want to apply for the third call for master's program only. And don't forget, you can also move 
with your family and they are you know special they are special um a uh, uh, package of funds for special student okay which of course one of them one of the um uh, criteria is that if you have children you can also be uh, uh, eligible for extra 250 euro for people with special uh, uh needs or special students so you know that is in addition with one with the 1400 uh, monthly stipend okay so this is the opportunity that i want to provide to all my viewers and subscribers once again if you are just seeing my channel for the first time like and subscribe to our channel don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that by the time we drop opportunities and information like this you will be the first person to get notification also follow us on all our social media platform okay thank you very very much once again for listening it will come your way next time bye bye for now